Hey guys, I didn't make a video for a really long time. The reason why was school and the really big tests. But now I'm going to make a new video about fishing. I, I've really been interested in fishing for a really long time now, over the summer. And I really got interested in fishing, so I got some fishing stuff I'd like to show you guys. I got two fishing rods that I'm going to be using this summer. One is called a Dino Interline Rod. And the other one is a Tsunami 5 Star. It's a 9 foot rod and the other one is a 6 foot rod. And the Tsunami I'll be using for beaches for very long casts, very far casts, for very big fish. It's very durable. And for the Daiwa I'll be using at Sheepshead Bay. Sheepshead Bay is a canal that we can fish with the Nissan for boats there. So I will show you the Daiwa right now. It's an interline rod. People are not really good with interline rods. I don't know why. They're not really, how can I say, it? not really, well, they can't really fish with them because of the interline and because it's very confusing to put the line in. So I'll just show you it right now. It's right over here. It's right over here. This rod is six feet. As you can see, there's only one ring to put in the line. This is the end of it. Right there. This is the rod itself. It's made up of graphite. It's again, just to tell you again, it's by Daiwa, Team Daiwa. Right here it says the name and everything. That it's high module HSD graphite, so that means they said that it's really durable, and I mean like really, really, like look at this, very durable. And I'll be using a reel that I'm going to be showing you later in this video. It's called a Dial Alexa H, Dial Alexa H reeling. It's a reel, very good one. I bought it at the local bait store, Bernie's Bait and Tackle, if you guys want to know, on Cheap Sunday on Emmons Avenue, and it's very good. The, I don't know the pin ratio on it, I kind of forgot it, but I'll show you it later in the video. The next rod I wanted to show you is actually a two-piece. It's actually a two-piece. This is the Tsunami. You see all the rings on it. These are all the rings. It's a two-piece rod. Cost me, run me about, I think like 100 something because it was, I got a real and uh, rod and real combo. I'm sorry if, if I sound stuffy. I'm kind of sick because of the weather. And yes, this these are the rings. This is not an interline rod. If you guys are on the ring, it's not. So you can see the rings. Now I'll show you the last piece of the whole entire rod because it's a two piece, not a one piece, like the Daiwa. This is the last piece of the rod. As you can see, this is rubberized grip. Over here, it's very, very soft. It's a cushion. So when you're fishing, you can put it right where your stomach is and get more grip, better grip. On the top, where the reel is, this is where the reel should be. If you guys can't see that, this is where the reel should be. Um, right over here is the grip, extra grip. And this Tsunami rods, they really focused about grip and strength how durable they would make it and that they will be really durable to make it but they focus more about the grip so you can see how long your grip is and over here another piece of grip so this is where the reel is and this is where the grip should be now it says over here that it can put nine feet of line and a wear one through four alls and right over here is the logo if you guys want if you guys are wondering what kind of company this is, it's a Tsunami. Right here it says Tsunami. Very good company, Rod. And I put very trust into it when I'm fishing because it's very durable. If you guys want a really durable and really hard rod that won't snap on you, won't break, won't, won't like be destroyed by the water and not rust. Very good rod. I had it for two years already. It's been working wonders on me. I caught striped bass, sea robin, porgy, every fish you can think on the beach, on the rocks. But very good. I recommend it for beginning fishermen that don't really fish a lot. 
Well, since I fished a lot, like three years already, I consider it, consider it, this is a very good lot for you guys out there that don't fish a lot, fish like once a month. But for me, very good rod. So I'm going to use it all over and over again. This is a very good rod. Alright, um, next thing I want to show you was I showed you guys the, I was talking about the reel. Now I'll take it out right over here. Never opened it yet. This is why I wanted to wait. Right over here it says the Dial Alexa 100H. This is all the fishing equipment, and I'll be getting more fishing equipment. As you can see, all over here, there are the ratios on it. Um, so far, this is a very good reel, and I'll be unboxing it. As you can see, I still didn't open it, it's fully closed. But I got spool I spooled it with braided line. Like eleven, maybe twelve. Still didn't open it, never touched it yet. As you can see, Dial X one hundred right over here. As you can see, I'm letting this line out right here. Letting line out, letting line out, letting line out. And just feel it in. Um, what I like about this rod that you can change it right over here. These are where your gears are, where you can change everything. Over here, the spinning part, right over here, this wheel part basically. It's these things coming out, these sharp things, right over here. Right over here. I don't know if you guys can see that. Right over here is where the drag comes in, how fast you want the fish to escape on it. But it's a very good rod. I'm going to use it for bait casting because it's a bait casting reel. Right over here. And the review on this is I never used it yet, so I would never know it. But my friend actually went to vacation on the Cayman Islands. And I'll have a review for you next time he comes with the reel. His reel, not mine, because he already used it. And the reason why he got the reel when I, when I uh, bought the reel in the bait shop with my dad and him. He realized how good it was it, and he wanted one for himself, so he bought it. The next day he went to vacation, he was he, he told me the reel is very compact. It has very smooth, very smooth when you turn it and reel in the fish. Um, he wanted to came announce the fish for tar, tarpoon, I believe, and other various of fish in the Cayman Islands. There's a lot of exotic fish there, but um, I can't wait till she sends me pictures, shows me the fish. But um, I'll be making more fish videos about fishing, I'll have pictures about it, I'll have some videos when I'm actually fishing out on the sea. But yeah, this has been my video of the two rods and the one reel. The reel cost about 175 bucks with a braid, but I got it for 120 because I know the deals in uh, Bernie's Bane Tackle. And again, I want to shout out Bernie's Bait and Tackle for seeing this reel. And if you buy this reel, you get the special card where you can get $25, $25 for free of a Dial and gift card. And you just put your name and address and send it to Dial and Phoenix. And in like a week, they sent you a free gift card with 25 bucks on it, which is already registered and it's free. So you can buy. Alright, peace out guys.